A viral social media trend is costing local school districts some money. Good evening, I'm Robert Hadlock. And I'm Britt Marino. Thank you for joining us. Well, we're talking about TikTok. It says it's removing content related to what's been dubbed the Devious Lick Challenge. This is when students post videos of themselves vandalizing or stealing from the school's bathrooms. KXAN's Tahara Rahman reports several Central Texas school leaders are trying to deal with the aftermath. This morning, they noticed that the urinal was gone from the bathroom. Michelle Francis's high schooler has seen the destruction of TikTok challenges firsthand at his Leander ISD school. Soap dispensers ripped off walls like this one in California and broken mirrors in San Antonio. Now, Austin, Hayes, Leander, and Round Rock ISDs all say they're repairing school bathrooms. Students are no longer being available to go to the bathroom in between classes, they have to make it to their classroom and then ask to be excused to use it. Leander and Austin school officials say they've already issued consequences to some students. With AISD and Round Rock warning, the criminal mischief means students could face legal consequences or jail time. So why do some challenges, whether harmful or even criminal, tend to go viral on TikTok? Well, one UT professor says one factor has to do with the platform's young user base. We know that brains aren't fully formed until they're 25. Uh, we know that teenagers in particular use the emotional side of their brains to make decisions instead of the rational side. Natalie Brown Devlin studies advertising and public relations. She says each view, like and comment triggers a feel good brain chemical. When we look at TikTok as a platform, it's so it's a seamless hit of dopamine. She says the platform is especially enticing for teens because it doesn't prioritize accounts with lots of followers or previous likes. Anyone can get millions of views. Posting content and engaging in challenges like this is essentially like them buying a lottery ticket and hoping today is the day that they win, break through, and go viral. Tahira Rahman, KXAN News. Austin ISD says they're looking at about two and a half thousand dollars in repairs at just one middle school.